Hey guys, Skidoo Backcountry expert Dave Narona here today with the all new 2017 Skidoo Summit Rev. And today we're specifically going to talk about the electric start. Now I know it's a long debated subject for most uh, sledders out there whether or not to get E start. And uh, there's no doubt that the pull start is lighter, but after you pull a sled, uh, 40 to 50 times a day if you're just sledding and that number actually climbs to 80 to 100 if you're sled skiing There is no debate that you're using more energy pulling over the sled than you are just pushing the button So the battery on the 2017 Summit Rev G4 is located in the back of the machine and it's actually designed into the back of the fuel tank So it lies nicely right in there the wires will run under the fuel tank and then hook up to the battery. Now this does two things, it actually gets it out of the front uh, end of the engine compartment and that allows for that narrowing of those side panels by four inches overall. It also puts it back here so it's actually easier to service your chain case because in electric start models in the past you had to remove the battery so that eliminates one process and it's much easier to get at your battery as well. There is a battery cover as you can see in the picture that covers the battery and then what's really cool is there's a skidoo seat bag that actually screw, screws right in to the top of the seat bag as you can see in the picture. Now for those got, who are still worried about the weight, the best way to shave weight is to take the stock battery and chuck it into your garage and grab a lithium uh, battery here. Now the weight difference is huge. A stock battery weighs 14 pounds and this battery uh, from EarthX weighs only 3.1 pounds. So you actually um, lose almost, well you lose 11 and a half pounds right off the bat. And this battery has more cold cranking amps. There is one thing with lithium batteries is that they do tend to fall asleep, especially if you leave your sled outside overnight. Um, what, that ha what happens is all you have to do is press the start button. If nothing happens, hold it down for eight seconds, wait about 30 seconds to a minute, and then it'll fire right up. It's only for an initial start on very cold days, and it's just to warm up that battery. I've been using electric start for four and a half years, never had a problem, never needed a pull rope, as well as um, ne it, it's fallen asleep on me maybe twice in those four and a half years. So a lithium battery is a great option. And again, it just fits right into the back and then you put the cover on. So lots of choices out there, especially when you're snow checking a sled. And on that note, make sure you get your snow checks in soon as there are limited numbers of this Skidoo Rev Gen 4. So we wanna make sure those who want one, get one. We'll see you out on the snow.